What's up guys, we're back on another video, um, to read, and, hang on, make sure I close it. We're at the read, and we're doing a food review on a ton of food to see if you should get it and what we would rate it. So, and first we're going to try some spicy roll crab sushi from Walmart. And... I can take open. <laughs> Okay, just opens. There we go. Okay, got soy sauce right here. Wasabi and I think this is garlic ginger. Ginger sushi. And then how do you even open this? Open it from the top maybe? I don't know, I can't figure it out. Do you want it? I mean, if you want it, I don't care. Oh yeah. Put it in there. This looks so good. I know. I'm actually excited to try this. I have had this before and I really like it, but this is like one of the newer flavors that I haven't had. So, I'm gonna try it. That's wasabi, you know? Uh, I, mean, like I, put, I sometimes put wasabi on it. Let's just try one. Here's what it looks like. Uh, dip it in soy sauce. That's really good. Mm -hmm. That's a 10 out of 10. It's got like perfect amount of spice. And For the, Walmart sushi. With the saltiness of the soy sauce. It's and perfect. Then, it's also got a little bit of crunch almost too. Mm -hmm. It's just, I'm gonna try fresh one, and cold. I'm going to try one without soy sauce. Mm. That's good. What do you rate this? 10 out of 10, that's good. Yeah, okay. What do you want to try next? Um, I'm going to do the Mr. Beeper's part. Okay. So, got this miniature Mr. Beast chocolate bar. It's a Kona Crunch Bar and Mr. Beast. So, I've never had this before. Feastables. It's supposed to be healthier than regular chocolate, I think. Chocolate, I think. Okay. It looks like it has a lot looks of like crunch. a crunch bar. Here's what it looks like. Okay. <laughs> it's really hard. It tastes just basically tastes like a crunch bar. Mm. Like you get at the movie theater. I think it's I like the chocolate flavor better than the crunch bar. I think it's a little better. It is. I like it. I wish there was a little bit more, like, I wish that, like, instead of just having, like, the the nuts or seeds or whatever on the bottom, I wish they were kind of, like, all through. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. Nice and crunchy. Yep. What do you rate it? Uh like a 7 out of 10. I give it an 8.5 for me. Because it's like really hard. Well, like, it's like once you get to like crunch, the aftertaste mm -hmm. is really good. Think think of a crunch bar. I mean, it's basically that with the chocolate. Okay. I think, okay, we got glasses and then we got bubble milk tea. It's backwards, but I think this will taste really good. I've never had this. I'm going to have this. Is your boba in it? I don't think so. Okay. That's good. That's really good. It's not bad. It kind of tastes like tea. Like the aftertaste is like definitely weird. It's almost vanilla. It's good. It's I I I like it. Okay, that's pretty good. Um, I'd get it if I were you. It's, it's good. I'm yeah. going to drop my milk mustache. I'm not I think old. 9 out of 10. I gave, I gave it 9 out of 10 too. It's, it's good. It's, like it's, 
<laughs> it's a creamy, like, think of an iced coffee. But, um, uh, like, sweet. Um, That's what I think. It's really try good. The coffee chips? Sure. Yeah. I got these coffee fuego chips. Um, I think these are going to be really good. Me too. Because I like the coffee, but... Cues at the end. Mm, that's good. I honestly don't think it's as spicy and spiced up as a real taki, but they're good. Mm -hmm. It's from both the spice tolerance. They're good. If you're looking for something like a little less spicier than mm -hmm. a taki, these chips are the way to go. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, moving on. I think we should try this. Yeah. So, okay. Don't, don't do the next one. Oh, like seriously, man. Here we have a Jamaica. And I don't really know how to cut it. Is it like a potato? Uh, um, <clears throat> you can eat it raw. Almost like a coconut. Yeah. You eat the skin? Yeah. Skin. Did you wash it? No, mm, it's good. Mmm. It tastes like an apple. Mm. But it's tough like a radish. That's really good. That's gonna do like a potato. But then, it's got a funny aftertaste. Yeah. Just a little skin off. with the aftertaste. Yeah. Mm. You want that? You want me? You can try it. It tastes like an apple. It's really good. <laughs> okay. I'm going to try this bra with no skin. That's good. It does taste like an apple. It doesn't... Yeah. The skin has the funny aftertaste. Uh, lemon pepper. I'm gonna try some lemon pepper. On it? Yeah. Okay. Let's try it. chili lime. It's chili lime. <laughs> <laughs> this is lemon pepper. I just wanna make a big mess because I don't want your dad to get mad. That's really good. Mm. It tastes like a talkie. I'm okay. It's cool. Mm. I'll try some of it. I'll cut you more. Or you can do it if you want. Okay, okay chili lime powder. I'm using it. I'm using 445. I'm using 445. That's good. <laughs> I think that's good. I'll rate it six, maybe. It just has a weird aftertaste. It would be better if it didn't have such a weird aftertaste. Oh, itself, without the skin on it, I give it a six. But with, with the, the lemon pepper or the it. chili lime, I'd give it an eight. It's really good. Yeah. Same for me. See a toxic place, where there's caramel apple and under the pretzels. Okay. So here are pretzels. They're like pretzel little pretzel buns. They have salt. I don't like salt. Oh, you can sprinkle some of the seasoning on it.
open. This looks really good. I'm not... It does. It almost, I almost think it's got sugar in it. Not good. It's, it's like, actually like a pretzel. It is. But it's like really fluffy. Hold on. It's really good. Hold on. Fat. Mm, it's good. I'm gonna try it right now. Whoa. Don't overpower it. <laughs> That's good. Mm. I really just kind of like that. I give it a nine. Cause you can put salt on it to make it taste like a real and natural cheese. And warm it up. Mhm. Mm and natural cheese with it, this would be very good with natural cheese. Mhm. Mm Want to do the toxic waste or the? This is super good. Okay. <laughs> okay. Now moving on to dessert, we have burgers. <coughs> um. Caramel apple. Mm -hmm. And there's apparently green apple filled. So. This is a cut hit. Oh, it's got a green apple filling. That's good. At home. Mm -hmm. oh. mm. That's good. Yeah. That's really good. Kind of a ten out of ten. Yeah. It almost turns into. I don't know. It's like. It's like gooey, but. The caramel apple sucker, but like the caramel wasn't. Yeah, hard. exactly. Like that, you can chew through it. Uh huh. Okay. Now I'm trying to get this toxic waste open. Can't get it open. Okay. Toxic waste. It's got. Some warnings on the back. This one's got citric or malic acid in it. Let me see. Yeah. Let me see. Ripper. Which one do you want? Let's pour it out. There's got to be a lot. I'm going to go for a green. I'm going to. Just like this. Oh, for Red. I don't have to cut it open. Here, let me get. <laughs> yeah. Oh, where's Boba? Oh, there is. Oh, you here? You can have the Boba. Fine. I still, I got like the even amount. You just got. Okay. It looks like you have a little bit. Did you did you eat it yet? No. Ready? Yeah. Three. This is what it looks like. This is the red cherry, I believe. This, Black cherry. This green apple, I think. Okay. Yeah. Ready? Three, two, two one. Let's go. I'm not very good with sour stuff. Keep it away from your tongue. Not bad. Like it's not, I didn't even make a face. Not I, I'm not very good with sour stuff, but it tastes very good. I'm gonna go for another one. I'm gonna go for the blue raspberry kind. Apparently, there is boba in this. 
Looks like that. Is it good? Mm. It's like rubber. It doesn't really have a flavor. It doesn't look appetizing because it looks like deer poop. <laughs> Like it would be good, but it is. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah, that's... You're doing it wrong. Okay. Here's what the blue raspberry looks like. I'm doing the same. Blue raspberry. Three, two, one. This this time I don't got any boba. <laughs> Is it sour? I'm really bad at it. <laughs> Not for me. <laughs> My eyes are watering. I want to have some coffee wings. These are good, though. Is it really that bad? <clears throat> it's not bad for me. I'm gonna I'm gonna one second. I got one last <laughs> I'm going to do another one. Probably because you sucked on it. I bit into it like as soon as I got it in my mouth. Sounds really wrong. I would not <laughs> That's what you're supposed to do, but as you can tell, it's not the best idea. That's what that looks like again. It is a hard candy, too, but. Soft and gooey on the inside. I got okay. cotton candy flavored dipping dots. I have not had these ever. I've had dipping dots. Well, I've had dipping dots. It's got cotton candy. Mm -hmm. mm, that's good. Oh, I give the um, the sour candies, a 10 out of 10. Yeah. You, just got, you just gotta be, know what you're doing when you're eating them. Mm. Mm. Uh. Okay, good candy for like, around the pool. Like. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But you don't want them to set. You don't want to let them set out in hot because they get sticky and they get hard to open. And that candy, um, like a, just a good summer treat. Yeah. These tacky chips, though, very really good. Yeah. Oh well. Says your dad be home around five o'clock. Mm -hmm. Okay. Overall, pretty good. You should be home in a minute. Yep. Yep. Well, thanks for watching. Overall, I give it a 9 out of 10. Yeah. It was all pretty good. Yep. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next time.